let's quickly understand about the output panel of UiPath Studio. This box or this tab over here is output panel. Whenever we execute some activities in our studio, they will generate few logs and that we can actually see in this particular output panel. We already have a message box in our sequence and when I just try to run it, here is a message box and we can see few logs that has been generated. So it is logging when the process has started and when it has ended and how much time did it take this particular time and there are different tabs available over here to us this particular clock symbol will allow us to have the timestamps displayed like this if I just click on that it will hide and if I double click on that it will show the data this will represent the errors and the orange symbol over here will show us the warnings and this I symbol will show the information and the grayed out I will show us the traces this will export the logs and this will help us to clear the logs if I just use log message so we can use log message at different stages of our process log message is an activity that we can use I have dragged it and there are different types of log levels we can decide it can be error it can be warning it can be info it can be trace let's use warning over here um, the warning here it is as we have talked earlier that we have to pass some values to this particular activities to the property panel I have did the same I have passed a string to it and a value set to warning I'm saving this thing and I will try to run it so this time I have got the message box and a warning this warning is because of this particular activity if I just un select that it will go if I select it it will show the warnings you can remove any unnecessary details that you don't want to display it over here if I just click on I the trace has gone similarly if I just want to hide information I can click on this based on your convenience you can enable and disable this particular options that was about output panel